Hi, it's Laura from Time Mummy 2 back again with another Christmas toy review. Now this time I'm looking at Lucy from IMC Toys. So it's part of the club's pet range. Lucy's been around for a while and is a huge hit. One of the best sellers last year and this year. So we're going to have a look at exactly what she does to see why she's worth the money and why there's such a hype about her. So let's get her out of her box. Now I love the IMC toy review, uh, toy selection especially from the club pets range at the moment there's yo-yo the panda uh cow cow the koala blue blue the dolphin was one of my children's favorites and we um reviewed lola the puppy earlier this year who actually works with lucy um to do a few tricks so let's get lucy out of her box really lovely packaging on this one I really I quite like the fact that they put a lot of thought into the design of the box rather than just it being sort of a plain colored background now Lucy is tied in so let's untie her she's only tied in with some string at the back they're not loads and loads of things to undo which is good and let's have a, have a look at the bottom. So she's tied in on the bottom with two strings. So one for each set of legs, I suppose. Let's undo that one. And undo this one here. Well, it says on the box, Lucy is for ages three plus. So I expect this to be a fairly easy to use toy. Um, you wouldn't want it to be too complicated for that sort of age range so it's not going to compete with some of the animatronic toys that are for really old uh, older children so this says it takes four double a batteries but there's obviously demo ones included so let's she's on try me at the moment let's turn her on to on um so i had got my batteries out ready but there's obviously some in there um they're obviously going to be just demo batteries because they're the ones for when you're pressing her ear through the box but we'll we'll work with those at the moment so let me pop my screwdriver and my batteries out of the way for another toy so let's have a look we've got three different pressure points on lucy so we've got her ear We've got her back. And her nose. So it, she says she's got voice commands. So Lucy responds to 15 different voice commands. She barks, sniffs, moves, and can even give kisses and do handstands. You can call her whatever you like so that she'll answer you. And she also has two buttons for activating some of her actions. So it gives you different things, tells you about battery, and it says voice commands or orders. To give voice orders, first say the name that you recorded previously so that she will listen. Oh, so where did we have to record the name? I obviously missed that one. Okay, with the switch in the on position, follow these steps if you want to record another name for the dog besides Lucy. Press the dog's left ear and she'll bark once. Say the name that you prefer for her, for example, Lucy, and she'll bark twice. She doesn't seem to be barking for me. Let's turn her off and try that again. It might be because I've already switched her on and then didn't do this straight away. So. Lucy. 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 Right, there you go. So she barked twice to say that she accepted her name. And then says, then repeat her new name for her. For better voice recognition, use a different tone of voice or in intonation until she barks twice. If she does not bark twice, repeat her name again until she does, which is what I did. So lastly, repeat the same name. Use a different intonation this time if you prefer until she barks once. If she does not bark once, repeat her name again until she does. She can now recognise the name you have given her. Lucy! 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 
Lucy! Lucy! Lucy! Lucy! Lucy! Right, so now we're going to try and give her some voice commands to see if this has worked. So it says, first say the name that you recorded, and if she's understood you, she'll bark once. You must wait for her to stop barking before saying one of the following voice commands. If she does not recognise your voice order, repeat her name, wait for her to bark, and say the order to her again. Remember that Lucy cannot hear you while she is making a sound or moving, so that she can understand you better. There should not be too much noise around you. So let's have a look um, and see what we can do. So there is 15 different voice commands, so let's see if we can do one. Lucy! Lucy! Do I have to press anything? Lucy! Lucy! She's not listening to me. Lucy! Sit! Lucy! Dance. Lucy, shake hands. <laughs> this is very cute. Okay, let's try this one. Lucy, on your head. <laughs> Lucy, berry. Lucy, eat. Lucy, Lucy, walk. Yeah, that was that was sit. That wasn't walk. Lucy, Lucy, walk. <laughs> She's gonna fall off the table. Um, Lucy, search. Very cute. Let's try another one. Lucy, stand up. So there's a variety of other commands like hello, give me a kiss, get up, lay down, things like that. But what I like about this is it's not overly complicated. You literally just say her name. Lucy, lay down. And she does what you say. Obviously you have to speak clearly, which is why um, some kids might have difficulty with it. They do have to pronounce properly um, for her to listen, which is why she sat when I told her to walk. Lucy. <laughs> I can see why it's a top toy. Um, it's nice and simple, easy to use, extremely soft around the face. It's only the body that's hard um, and just generally really, really cute. So I like that and I like the fact that she's got touchable places as well. So it's not just about the voice commands. So I could touch her hand and she thinks I'm feeding her. Um, and obviously I could touch her, her ear and she barks and I could touch her back. Um, and you know, I just think that that's really cute. Lucy's definitely gonna be one of the, like the big toys um, of this year and because it was out last year she would have dropped in price slightly so it's actually a really good time to get it and don't forget you can get the little puppy Lola who interacts with Lucy and they have even more commands when they're together so instead of 15 commands Lucy will gain extra commands when paired with Lola so that's something that's really good to look out for if one of you for example if Lucy was the big main present and then a family member bought Lola because it's at a lower price point they'll be able to play together as well, which would give that added play factor for kids. So yeah, I really like this. As I said, this is Lucy the dog from IMC Toys. Now, do give me a, a like um, and maybe subscribe to the channel to see more toy reviews. And if there's something that you wanna know about Lucy or if there's a toy that you want us to review, do pop it in the comments below um, and I'll see what I can do. I'll see you soon, bye.